The Thompson Center Strike is a 50 caliber striker fired muzzleloader that was initially sold as the LHR Redemption. Since Thompson was bought out by Smith & Wesson, the rifle has been renamed the Strike. Sleek lines and a forward jutting trigger guard scream modern, but it's the firing features that set the Strike apart from most other black powder guns. A new ADAPT breech system moves the threads to the outside of the barrel, theoretically eliminating seized breech plugs and simplifying the cleaning process. There are also a pair of included threadless primer adapters that hold the 209 primer. One adapter is made for loose powder, while the other is specific to formed pellet propellants. The Armor Knight metal finish is essentially a nitride coating on both the outside and inside of the barrel that is intended to increase the barrel life. The 24-inch barrel has a 1-in-28 rifle twist, touted to be ideal for today's high-performance projectiles and modern sabots. Also setting itself apart from other muzzleloaders, including the Encore, is the Strike's new Stealth Striker ambidextrous caulking system, replacing the standard hammer. In the end, the sliding striker should be more quiet and less intrusive than the stand-up hammers, which can interfere with optics. A match-grade trigger is standard on all models of the Strike, and immediately sets it apart from most other black powder rifles. Adjustable fiber optic sights are included, as is a Weaver scope base. Taking a page from the Pro Hunter book, the Strike also incorporates the Quick Load Accurizer muzzle system, which essentially means there's a false, rifleless section of the muzzle allowing projectiles to be seated squarely and evenly for maximum accuracy potential. The rifle comes with a limited lifetime warranty for the original purchaser. There are currently three models of the Strike available. A black synthetic, a G2 camo and a walnut with MSRPs of $499, $549 and $599 respectively. We ran our rifle through a number of tests including a variety of ammo. It performed very well but there were a small few issues. Please read the full review on Guns.com where we go into much more detail about the Thompson Center Strike. It is a fine rifle. There's a link directly below the video if you're not already on the page. And don't forget to subscribe to the Guns.com YouTube channel to enjoy many more fun and informative videos such as this.